Hello, Cecil County and the world. This is Cecil.tv, Cecil Weekly, and I'm your host, Rob Churnside. We have a special show tonight with a guest from Rising Sun talking about the Sun Fest. We have a clip from the Ice Plunge down there at the Wellwood Yacht Club this past weekend, and we have our musical guest, Sam Anderson. And it's Mardi Gras, so laissez les bon temps rouler. Welcome, Vince Thank from you. Rising Sun. Thank You're you going to talk me. to us about Sunfest. Yes, yes, I am. Great. It's when is it this year? Uh, it's going to be. It's always the first Saturday of June, and this year it'll be June third. Um, it'll start at nine a.m. with a parade, and it'll end at four o'clock. All day. All day. What if it rains? I hate to say that. Well. Luckily, since I've been running, we haven't had any rain. However, if there is rain, it's rain or shine. So the show will go on. So you've got the mojo. Uh, somebody's got the mojo. I don't know if right, it's me, that's, but that's yeah, awesome. it's been, we've been pretty uh, lucky with that. And you're affiliated with the Chamber of Commerce of Rising Sun. Yes, yeah, the Rising Sun Chamber of Commerce uh, puts us on every year and have been for 28 years. Well, it's a wonderful event. And I got to tell you, I really should make it this year because I've been living in Cecil County 30 years. And I haven't been yet, but I intend to come there and look for you. Okay, correct. And my friends from One Eye Jacks who are going to be playing music, correct? That's correct. Uh, later in the afternoon after the pie eating contest and the tug of war between the town and the chamber, uh, we're going to have the One Eye Jacks perform and, and see us out through the rest of the event. Now, the pie eating contest, is it quantity or timed? How does that work? Completion. <laughs> so. Um, it's, it's epic too, by the way. You guys really have to come out and see that. So, so we have different uh, levels of age that participate, and we have for the little guys we have the, the smaller uh, pies, and for the you know the grown ups we have larger pies. And the object is to not use your hands, and you have to stick your face in this pie, and it varies. You know, sometimes they're blueberry, blackberry, what whatnot, and they have to stick their face right in the pie, and they have to complete eating the entire pie without um, hurling or any other type of excretions from their body in order to, to be the winner. And they do receive a medal for the pie eating contest at the end as well. I would think so. <laughs> yeah. That's an awesome accomplishment. <laughs> yeah. Well, that sounds like fun already. So tell us more about how Sun, Sun 28 years, right? This mm -hmm. will be the 29th year. Mm -hmm. And who was the, who started Sunfest, really? Well, um, uh, Norman Hunter, uh, originated the Sunfest because people used to call in to Rising Sun from Elkton and elsewhere in the county and never really knew where Rising Sun was. So the the business organization at the time, it wasn't called the Rising Sun Chamber, it was called the Rising Sun uh, Business Association or something like that. Uh, they wind up putting together uh, an event to try to bring people into the town so folks know where Rising Sun was. And every year they continue to carry on that tradition uh, to let people know where Rising Sun is. Well, good. I know where it is. You know where yeah. it is. But I guess there are some people, even in Cecil County, who don't know where Rising Sun is. This is the guy who's going to tell you. And this is the guy, folks, if you have an act and you want to get involved, there's music, there's other kinds of acts, right? What else do we have? Yeah, um, we, we used to have a talent show that we try to perform, but it's kind of uh, ad hoc. It depends on how many people show up. So if we get enough participants to show up, we would probably do a talent uh, contest as well and give away prizes and whatnot for that as well. So Vince, people should contact you the sooner the better to line up for this rapidly filling up uh, Sunfest, That's right? correct, yes. We have a couple email addresses where we can be reached. Um, the, the easiest way is probably go to our, our website, which is sunfest.us, not .com, US. So it's sunfest.us. And it'll have everything about a parade. It'll have everything about the entertainment that's going to be there. And they have the real-time vendors. So whenever a vendor signs up, it's online instantly. So uh, check, check frequently to see if your favorite vendor's there. That and sounds great. And it'll be here before we know it. Yes. Anything else you want to add about Rising Sun, the Chamber, or Sunfest? Uh, yeah, we, we actually uh, expanded the event last year. We doubled our size. Uh, we get, had uh, access to another parking lot that's adjacent to the, the event arena. And uh, last year was probably the biggest ever because since we doubled our population as far as vendors that could participate. And we had quite a, quite a large crowd there. 
Uh, we're going to bone up on the bathrooms this year because, you know, we doubled our size and didn't really double the bathroom capacity. So we're doubling the bathroom capacity this year. Uh, so there's no lines for the, the bathrooms this year. But not like the old time Rising Sun Outhouse thing that used to happen, right? No. no, <laughs> no not like that. No. We'll get into that later. Yeah, that's another story. <laughs> it's great to have you here on Cecil Weekly. And Vince, we're looking forward to June 3rd, uh, Rising Sun Sunfest. And I know I myself, I'm going to start practicing eating those pies. <laughs> Thank you, you very much. Thank you.